Welcome back everyone. Uh, today we at Basement Studios have a new mock. This is our expanded pizzeria and bike shop mock. Uh, this is from one of the uh, Lego City pizzeria and bike shop sets and we have expanded it to be a much larger building and uh, actually two larger buildings. The bike shop not so much, but both of them now have backs, which is I think a good thing. And what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at the exterior of the buildings first and then we'll move on to the interior. And let's just start with the exterior here. Starting on the bottom here, we've got the uh, pathway looking very similar to the modular builds and that is because we're trying to fit them in with the rest of the modular builds. As you can see on the side there there's some profile bricks along with a staircase leading up to the second floor. That is because the second floor is actually an apartment that we put up there and uh, it is assumed that the person who works in the pizzeria or who may own it is actually the owner of the apartment as well. Now you can see we've added uh, these three windows and a uh, door with the pizza uh, stickered on there. This is one case where stickers really did come in handy and there's some more sticker uh, windows up there to kind of advertise. And as you can see we've got a couple of uh, actually f uh, six of the same colored profile bricks down there, kind of to give a nice added touch to that. And there's the bike shop over there. We'll swing around to there in just a second. Uh, the roof, we tried to kind of go off of what the Lego set had going on. Same with the second floor. But we did take quite a bit of artistic uh, freedom to be able to do as we pleased with that. As you can see up there, there's a little chimney along with, I think that red bit was actually the original chimney, I'm not sure, but we added our own. And this is a couple of uh, profile bricks once again, along with on top of this little chimney-esque looking thing, on top of a 2x2 two two, uh, plate with one knob or jumper plate as it is sometimes cold. Okay, so now I'm going to flip this around. And that's kind of sticking out there. Okay. So here's the exterior of the bike shop. You can see in the window there's a bike. And the sign here, which hangs down really low, is actually a sign with a flag that has a bicycle on it. So that goes right there. And this door opens up like so. It says bike shop on the sign there. And we will get to see the interior of that in just a moment. But until then I'm going to flip this around one more time and I'm going to present the back of the pizzeria. And as you can see there is a dumpster, which is actually a recycling dumpster uh, from I believe a Lego City fire department set, or not the actual building, but just the just a little fireman putting out a fire inside there. And then there's a trash can and there's a little person, just a minifigure sitting underneath the stairs. And so that is the exterior of this build. So now I'm going to flip this around and we can take a look. Uh, I'm going to start with the interior of the bike shop and then we'll move on to the interior of the rest of the build. The top does not open super smoothly. There's a couple of, there's about a 
one by six brick here that keeps coming off all the time, but that's not a real big deal to us. So we're doing with what we can with what we have. So I'm gonna pull this forward. And let's take a look inside the interior of this bike shop. Okay. So, the interior of the bike shop is very plain. Here we have the attendant who's working the shop. Got some bike helmets there, skateboard, and you can kind of see it. The bike right there is on a pedestal. And then there's a oil can and a wrench and a hat. And that is about it. There is another clip on the wall right here. You can't really see that too well. But that is the interior of the bike shop. It is very, very plain. Not much going on in there. The main focus here was on the uh, pizzeria and the apartment above. Especially the apartment above. Okay, so... Now I am going to get this back down to a level height and we'll move it back here and we'll take a look first at the bottom layer of the pizzeria. So here's the bottom layer of the pizzeria. Our attendant, the owner, whatever, we actually made him out of the Minotaur minifigure just as a farce, you know, not just for fun, just for kicks, you know. So he's standing there, and then you've got the pizza oven and three glasses on the wall, and a couple of fountains there for filling up the glasses, along with there's some cupboards right behind him. The floor is tiled with dark and light tan tiles, and there's nothing back around here too much, but as you can see, there are different people here eating. I'll s scoot this around so you can see better. We've got a couple people there. It looks like someone with Frodo hair is there. Anyway, that's pretty much the bottom, so I'm going to put on the next layer, and we will look at the apartment really quick. Okay, so now here is the apartment. We have the kitchen dining room here and I'm gonna flip this around so you can see it better. We have a microwave up top here that is stuck in the wall on this side I believe. Cabinet, oven, and stove with four metallic one by one uh, flat uh, round tiles. A refrigerator here, which should open, but it's not doing anything right now. It's kind of a really tough piece to get open. This is a jumper plate here. I'm not sure if you can see that real well. That we were gonna put something on top of there. Um, not sure if we're gonna do that anymore. It's sort of like right here, there's a jumper plate underneath these flowers trying to uh, brighten the place up a bit, you know? And then right here we've got a faucet and sink for the kitchen. And then right here is a dining room table. Very simple construction. Just got these two nice little chairs sitting here. No big deal. And then there's the bedroom. Nothing special, just a little bed, uh, checkerboard pattern, as well as a small nightstand on the side there. 
and then last but not least we have the tiniest bathroom in the world <laughs> and it's very hard to get into and see so I'm gonna raise this camera up So we have our little bathroom here with uh, light gray and blue uh, tiles there for the flooring. Small custom toilet that is also found in our apartment mock, gray, uh, the tall gray apartment mock. Small sink and some flowers. And uh, there is no shower in this apartment and I, I don't think there would have been room for one. I mean, if we had decided to downsize on the kitchen or bedroom, but we have pretty much downsized as much as we are willing to do. So this is basically what we have. Uh, anyway, um, that uh, is pretty much the top floor. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. This has been the Pizzeria and Bicycle Shop Expanded Mock. Um, hope you enjoyed, and uh, I think there will probably be a uh, link to the, or at least the set number of the original set in the description. Uh, this is the Pizzeria and Bicycle Shop Expanded mo uh, Mock, and I hope you enjoyed. Uh, see you next time. Bye-bye.